Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Altia Verona Plus. This is your host, Eternal Dreamer Zero, and we are to go to um, someplace. Uh, travel. Artis uh, Palace Front Desk, yes. Yep, much better graphics than before. Why do I have to do this? <laughs> I mean, she always makes me do everything. Of course, you know how Asta is. <laughs> Am I here already? I think this is the first time I've ever been to the castle. <sighs> I'm getting nervous. That messenger guy was scary. Who was scary? Ah! You scared me. <laughs> Sorry about that. Can I help you? You don't look like one of my clients. I, I, I'm actually from the workshop. Uh, this guy. Oh no. I forgot to get his name. Um, huh? the workshop? Oh, I know what's going on now. Come with me. I'll show you the way. Uh, okay. Thank you. All right, here we go. on the inside. I better not look around too much. There he is. That's the guy you're looking for, right? Yep. Yeah, yeah, that's him. Stirk, you've got a visitor. Huh? I think you scared her, Stirk. I did? With that scary look on your face. You have to be nice to girls, you know? Well, have fun. With her. Do do do. I'm <laughs> uh, just getting back in the swing of things. Um. Hello. He looks mad. What are you doing here? I thought I asked for Astrid. Well, uh, she said she wasn't in the mood. <laughs> so. Some people never change. Um, do you know her? She's just an old acquaintance. I guess I should introduce myself to you then. My name is Sturkenberg. I'm a knight of this castle. I know it's a bit long. But you can call me Sturkey. Can I call you Sturkey? Please call me Sturk. Aww, Sturkey is much cuter. Oh, and my name is Rorona. Pleased to meet you. Likewise. Anyway, about the workshop. That's right. Why are you closing down our workshop? Is it because Master's never there, and even when she is, she sleeps all day and never works? Or is it because nobody in town likes her? Or... Those are terrible things to say. <laughs> Though, I guess I should have explained it better. The closing of the workshop isn't official. Yet. We will give you assignments to complete and make our final decision accordingly. Assignments? The Kingdom will assign a job to the workshop, such as... Oh, and give you get the explanation of what assignments are. Report to Sturk once you have items. And from the kingdom, we'll give you every three months over three years for a total of 12 times. Every assignment will consist of making it something of alchemy and turning it into Sturk. Try to complete, complete the assignment by the deadline, or otherwise it's game over. Type of item, number of items. Yes, I believe this is all familiar to you guys who've played this once before. But if you're newly joining us, then yeah. Then we also have optional quests. Oh, but this is new. Make a line by collecting the stamps. Gain different bonuses by landing them. Oh, okay, so this is a little bit different. Yeah, they, they pulled it from, um, what was it? Out. I forgot what it was. Out. Out. She and Logi? Yeah. You will receive a bonus. Then, the card will receive a stamp when you complete the required thing for the item. Items for tickets. Okay, yeah, so then there are some new things. And that's about it. I'll let you know when your first assignment is ready. What if we fail an assignment over the next three years? Then we will close down the workshop immediately. Oh. 
Monsignor Esti, the lady that you met earlier, can help you with interacting with the townspeople. Yeah, that chance. <laughs> anyway, I know that was a lot of information to take in all at once, but please make sure to tell Astrid. Yes, of course. I better go back before I forget. Excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> we shall get to alchemy yet. <laughs> He's nothing like Astrid, which is a good thing, I guess. Hey, you can still jump. <laughs> oh, it's still hampered. All right, let's go to um at the same way. Oh, the jumping jumping is so st still hampered. I can't jump on the rail anymore. I can't draw water. Wait, wait what what the heck? I was j Where did I come out from? Okay. Let's forget those specifics. Oh man, this is weird. Ooh. Hey, her hair looks cooler. Who's his voice? I keep forgetting. Oh, headshot. Headbutt. Cordelia von Furbach. Yeah, Cory, don't tackle me like what? I was just trying to cheer you up since you look sad. You should be thanking me instead. Oh. You were trying to cheer me up? <laughs> Thanks! I do feel better now. Simple-minded or just plain dumb? Huh? What did you say? Nothing. So, what's the matter? Did that lady do something to you again? No. Well, sort of. Well, this guy from the castle came to the workshop today and... Blah, 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 blah. Oh, I see now. Well, I knew something like that was going to happen. You guys haven't had any customers for days. I know, but who cares? If the workshop closes, it won't affect anyone one bit. What about me? Corey, you're so mean. Do you remember the reason why you started working there to begin with? Of course. My parents got sick when I was little and the master gave us the medicine to heal them. Yeah, and... But I didn't have any money to pay for it. So... Decided to help her out at the workshop. Okay, so what'll happen if the workshop is closed down? Well, I wouldn't be able to work at the workshop, so I'd have to go home. Oh. See? No one's gonna care if the workshop is gone, along with that lady. That's kind of sad. Why? Does she even know about this? No. I was about to go tell her. Hmm. Then I'll come with you. I can't wait to see the look on her face when she finds out about this. <laughs> Corey, can't we all just get along? No way! Come on, let's go! Alright, so... I'm back! Master? I didn't think you'd still be here. You make it sound like I'm never here. Oh, and you're with the heiress of the Feuerbach family. Don't call me that! Fine. I'll call you Cory then. You know, to be friendly. No! I don't like this. I don't like that. Boy, you're so demanding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not demanding! Oh, but please don't fight! Anyway, I went to the castle. I know. I've been waiting for you to come back. We just went off on a tangent because of Cory. I didn't do anything! Ah, <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. I see. I knew they weren't going to close down this workshop right away. Can't you at least be a little freaked out? This isn't any fun to watch. Why don't you run around with your hands in the air crying, Oh no, my workshop! Or, I'm being exiled! Panicking won't solve anything. Besides, you seem awfully calm. Why shouldn't I be? <sighs> Rolona. And you call yourself her friend? 
You're gonna have to leave the kingdom too if the workshop is closed. What? Me too? What are you talking about? Don't drag her down with you! But Rorona owes me a ton of money. I can't let her go until she pays it all back. Or did you think I was going to be nice enough to forget all about it? You're right. I forgot your scum rotten through and through. I'll take that as a compliment. Either way, this is a good lesson for you. You can't just lie around all day like you used to. Everything will be all right. As long as you take this seriously. Of course. I'm sure I can do anything if I put my... Oh, I am so glad to hear that. Anyway, what are you making? Oh, this? It's just a new sign for the workshop. I thought it might drum up some business for us. So, you are putting some thought into this. It's ready. Let's go put it up. <laughs> what do you think? Not bad, huh? Aw, it's so cute! Atelier Rorona! We're changing the name of the workshop, too? Wait! What? This workshop is yours from now on. I'm counting on you. No, oh, no! I can't do this! It's impossible! What are you thinking? She's too nice, clumsy, dumb, and sheltered to own a workshop! You didn't have to say all that. <laughs> but it's true. I don't know anything about alchemy. You never taught me anything! Don't worry about that. Here, take this. Beginning what? alchemy. It's got all of the basics of alchemy written inside. My master gave this to me when I started training. It must mean a lot to you. You sure you want me to have it? Of course. You're my number one pupil. Master, thank you very much. I'll do my best. No, Verona, stop! She's just tricking you! Oh, I'm so tired from making the sign. I'd better go take a nap. <laughs> hey, wait! Verona, stop reading that book! What? Oh, Master, please, wait for me! Alright, it's time to begin the crafting. I really hope this is like in 60 frames per second. Sorry if I clicked that too fast. I tried to... Oh, look! Not there anymore. Oh no! What shall we do? <laughs> the workshop will be... Ooh, it's a letter! What is, shall it be? Don't worry, you can do this. I believe in you. Oh. Carry on your legacy. Which legacy of sleeping? Alright, so here we go! Onto the crafting parts! After this cutscene! Let me just double check if the synthesis is still the same. I don't think it would have changed, but... Come on, come on, show me if it's changed or not. Synthesis... Access cauldron... Blah blah blah... Read recipe, gather ingredients, and synthesize... Buy or gather... Uh, looks like it's all the same. Yep. Let's use this. Yay! Two baskets. No, wait. Oh. This is the couch. If you want to restore your energy, sleep on the couch. Oh, um, 
I can't use that stupid cheap thing to do anymore by just like eating by having HP. Okay, what else? Uh, I'm fine now. Year one, January. Get to work. I like how they're using a timpani for this. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Come on. Your first assignment. Polish powder, zetel, and alchemy gold. Okay. Consumables. We don't know what's possible. Well, <laughs> okay. And you do it. Wait, I'll be working forward to seeing your items. So, okay, first. Alright, let's go to the beefy weapon shop and get another cutscene. He has a hat. Did he always have a hat? Hey, go. Hello, Pops! Hey, hey! Welcome! Ah, oh, it's you! You here to sharpen your kitchen knives? Nope, I'm here to buy weapons. What? I don't agree with having some young lady carrying around a dangerous weapon! Well, it's not what the owner of a weapon shop should say. <laughs> well, I wish I didn't have to, but... Oh, so you have a reason! Why don't you tell me what it is? Okay... Well... And that's why you're going to run the workshop from now on. Yeah, I have to go outside of town to gather ingredients, too, so... And then you don't have a choice, huh? But unfortunately, I don't think you can handle what I've got. Aww, why not? Because, uh, well, everything I have is extra large. Uh, all of my customers are large men. So, uh, I only make weapons that are suited for those kinds of guys, you know? Oh, I see. What should I do? Ah, oh, come on. Don't make that face. Fine. Because you asked, I'll try to fix up something that you could use. Really? Thank you so much, Mr. Bold. Mr. Bold? I mean, Pops? <laughs> sure. You can count on me. I was close. I forgot he doesn't like being called by his last name. All right, let's go talk to him. To container. If we have. Yay! So that all stuff is really expensive. So that is why I did that there. Hmm. Okay, so we have that. Let's go to the Sunrise Cafe. We're gonna. Man, my throat is like feeling very sore now, so I apologize for that. Oh, I need to get a glass of water at some point. Ixel John. Hi, Ixy. Welcome. What's the matter? You don't look so cheery. So much is happening so fast. Do you want to talk about it? And would you like some tea? Thanks. What? You're the new owner of the workshop? Yeah. I don't even know how all of this happened. Damn it! I'm 
still in training and you're already going to be an owner. But you're so much better than me. Even though you're still in training, you do everything at the restaurant. I'm just being forced to do this because Master doesn't want to do it herself. Oh, yeah? <laughs> well, it's not as hard as you might think. And nothing's going to change if you just keep thinking about it. So cheer up. Thanks. I feel a little better now. I think I can handle this. There you go. Oh, and that'll be 150 coal for the tea. What? I thought it was going to be your treat. I'm just joking. Don't take it serious. Well, let me know if you need anything. I'm always here to help. Who is this? Cordelia. Okay, I am going to need some help. Okay, do do do. Where else should we go? We need to go to the sundries. Hello. Welcome, Rorona. There she is. Oh, she's so beautiful as always. Oh, I should buy something. Wait, I'm going first. I'm going to be the first one to get changed from her hands today. Yep, the creepy guys are back. Uh -huh. You're so popular. Thanks, at least my shop is always busy. Oh, I wish this many people came to my workshop, too. <laughs> I'm sure that's not too far down the road. I mean, the workshop is now owned by such a cute girl like yourself. Oh, you knew already? Yes, I heard from one of my friends. It's probably going to be very hard on you, so let me know if there's anything I can do to help. Aww, you're so kind. I wish you were my master. Oh, don't say that. You never know when she might be listening to you. You're right. Please keep what I just said between you and I. I know, I know. Anyway, good luck, and say hello to Astrid for me. Thank you! Ooh, Sundry's book. I should get it. Yes. Town Square. I just need to go talk to a bunch of people. Hello. Let's go to Palace Hall. Maybe we could can we get him to help out? Darn it. Alright, let's go to the front quest. Front desk quest. Oh gosh, this thing is still going! It's not stopping! No! Um item exchange. Supplement, constant plate. It's a grass. Let's go to the world map. Let's go to the nearby forest. Yes, yes, yes. We must gather in the first area. Yay! <laughs> this jumping is so crippled. 
Yay! Camera. Nope. Uh, log is good. Come on. There's gotta be good stuff around here. I suppose the first area is not gonna be not very good in making and getting good stuff. Yay. We gotta do this ten times, I assume. Another gathering area. Alright, let's go to the new area. Probably gonna be some monsters. There's a puny. Yes. Yes. All right, so let's see what happens when we attack. Uh, oh, that hurts. All servants. Dog. Kill Angel Shot. Ten. Oh wow. It was just getting fun. Oh. They haven't noticed us. Let's do this. Oh jeez. Oh boy. Out of my way. I gotta be really careful actually. Bearing HP and no healing. I should have at least bothered you can still. Now you've done it. Well. Ah, uh, that's what I get for being done. Here goes. Now you've done it. Leveled up! Uh -oh. I feel stronger! Yay! You're level two now. Okay, um I oh, darn it. Jump away. Gathering, yes. I must at least unlock the new areas. Oh gosh, Green Poony, run, 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 run. Ah, uh, this is gonna go ahead to monster, isn't it? Oh, place to gather. Yes. Let's gather random stuff all the time. Oh, Green Poony attacks. Ooh, oh, oh gosh, run. Arrow. Oh, yay. Adventure comes today. Hopefully there's no nothing guarding this area. Oh. Bye, Poony. Alright, we're gonna return to the workshop. Never shared a bed before. What did you do?
<laughs> Man, there's a lot of details in the thing now. It's better, far better than before. Laura. Ryan. I own a workshop now. <laughs> that took an extra day, but that's okay. Secret side of Verona. All right, read a book. Sundry's book. Barrel. Oh, I must check the barrel jokes. Yes, all of them. <laughs>